show you how to make vegetable soup. So what you'll need for the vegetable soup is I got a Campbell's beef broth. Uh, 900 milliliters, that's what it says. I got one tablespoon of flour with one teaspoon of paprika, three small bay leaves, with three cloves whole, uh, two teaspoons of sage, two teaspoons of pepper, and I'm not adding any salt because I think the beef broth already has salt in it. Uh, about a half a cup of green onions, a half a cup or three small carrots, um, a ginger, um, a quarter of an onion, yellow, um, four large cloves of garlic mince. Okay, I got um, one parsnip or uh, or two uh, half a cup of parsnip. I got one red bell pepper, and I got four. Leave, oh no, sorry, not four. Two leaves, two leaves of green cabbage shredded. As well as I got a half a cup, uh, I'm sorry, a quarter of a cup before it was cooked of jasmine rice. As well, I also got over here a teaspoon of butter and a teaspoon of sunflower oil. I forgot to mention that I'm also going to add, when I add the rice, I'm going to add two tablespoons of cream. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the pot on to medium heat. Come on. So now the butter and the oil is hot. I'm going to add some of my ginger, my onion, and my garlic. Okay, so now I'm going to add my flour and paprika. And I'm going to whisk. I'm going to stir that in. And now I'm going to add my beef stock. And my herbs. And the ginger. Cover and let um, reduce. Put on too high and let it come to a boil. I added two cups of water because it was not enough liquid for me. So you, if you want, you could make that all beef stock or all water. Or if you're vegetarian, you can make it mushroom stock. Okay, so now the water is boiling, so I'm going to reduce the heat to medium, and I'm going to let this cook for about five minutes. So now the five minutes are up, so I'm going to strain it. Now I'm going to try to leave the garlic in there, but the onion and ginger and, and bay leaves and cloves I'm going to take out. So now that I've strained out what I want to strain out, I'm going to add in my carrots, my red pepper, and my parsley. And I'm going to let that cook for 10 minutes. I added another cup of water. Now to the soup, I'm going to add my cabbage, and I'm going to let that cook for 5 minutes. So right now, I'm going to add my cream and my rice. And I'm going to cook that for another five minutes. So it's been another five minutes. So now I'm going to add our last ingredient, the green onions. And I'm going to let that cook only for two more minutes. It looks really good. And that's good for you. All the vegetables are cooked. Mmm, it has so much flavor, it has a lot of flavor, you should try this recipe, even if you're vegetarian, you can make it more vegetarian.